An attack in eastern Afghanistan has left at least 14 dead and dozens seriously injured. A suicide bomber on a motorcycle targeted a bus carrying army recruits on the way to the capital of Kabul for training. CCTV's Catherine James reports. This afternoon in eastern Afghanistan, the army bus was carrying recruits to Kabul was uh, targeted with a an explosive device that killed at least 14 of the new recruits and wounded over 35 others. The, uh, this explosion followed an earlier one in the north of Kabul which similarly targeted a bus of the Ministry of Education uh, employees in which two people were killed and at least five were wounded. This kind of event is something that is the uh, weapon of choice for the insurgency. These uh, remote controlled or roadside bomb uh, devices have been taking a huge toll on the country. And in terms of the army, we've seen already last year Afghanistan experienced a record number of casualties. And this, uh, this has led to the US Army Commander General John Nicholson questioning earlier this month whether the US would be able to withdraw as many troops as they would like to this year. The plan was for the uh, US to withdraw some, almost half of the 9,800 9, troops they have here, but he's now questioning whether that will be possible. Catherine James, CCTV, Kabul.